Hey everyone, it's Helper Joel here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up reaction rules in your Discord server using Dinobot. The first thing that we're going to do is go to our Discord server and add Dinobot. We can do this by going to the top left and clicking on the server name. And then on this drop down menu here, go down and select App Directory. Search for Dino in the search bar. Select Dino. Go to the right and select the blue add app option and then open this link that pops up. That's going to open this up in our browser here. And this is going to give us the option to add it to our server. So just select the server we want to add it to and then hit continue. Authorize all of these. Confirm that we are human. Then that's automatically going to bring us to the Dinobot website. If you wanted to access this later, it can easily be done by going to Dino's profile and clicking on the link here. But after we've added Dino to our server, we can now Go to the top left again, click on the server name, and go to the server settings. Once we're in the server settings, we're going to go to roles. And to have reaction roles, obviously we're going to need roles in our server. You may already have some, but I'm going to create a new one. Once you have your roles for reaction roles, one thing you need to do is make sure that Dinobot is above the roles here that you are trying to get with the reaction role. So if Dinobot was below it like this, I would need to make sure I drag it above. After you've done that, save your changes. Now we can exit out of this. And now we can go to Dinobot's profile and open up the Dinobot website. From here, you may need to sign in using your Discord, but once you've done that, you can go to the top right and select the Manage Servers option. And once you've selected the Manage Servers option, you'll see the servers that you have the bot in. So I'm just going to select the test server right here, which is where I added the bot. From here, go to the left and select Modules. On this page here, we're going to either search for or scroll and find the reaction rules option, which I have right here. Make sure it's turned on and then hit settings. Once you're in the reaction rule settings, here's where we can create our reaction rule. You can give it a name. The name doesn't really matter, so just do whatever you'd like. You're going to select the channel that you want the reaction rule message to be sent in. So I'm just going to say general. For message type, I'm going to select plain message. And then in this box here, I can type the message that I would like it to be. After that, I can come down here and on this add reaction option, I'm just going to hit this. Right here on the reaction option, I can select what emoji I'd like to use to react for the role. And then where it says roles, I can select the role that I want to get when I react to this message. After that, I can go to the bottom and hit save. And once I've done that, I can now go back to my Discord server. And as you can see, it has now added my reaction role here. So right now my profile doesn't have any roles, but if I hit this right here, and I go back to my profile, it then adds that role to my profile. I hope that this video helped you guys out. Please remember to like and subscribe.